Hey everybody, it's Dad and Ben. D&B Cards here once again. And what is tonight, Ben? Box Break Tuesday. Welcome to some more birthday magic. Ah, yes. So this was the second box. Uh, my wife uh, got me two boxes for my birthday. She got me the uh, Metal Universe, which uh, we were very, it. very fortunate. And yep. uh, we got some nice cards out of that. And, and it's white. And the cut. And the biggest hit we pulled is right there. That's right. With my favorite call. I love that. <clears throat> yeah, I was out today and uh, happened to be driving by one of the card shops. So stopped in quickly. Got a puck holder for Ben's special puck that came to him from his grandfather. And, and uh, we do have a video of that. <clears throat> that's true. That was part of a mail day back in the day. So yeah, if you want to see, uh, scroll back probably three, maybe four or five mail days. And you'll see Ben uh, open the puck there from his grandfather. But I put a handy dandy card in there with it as well. <clears throat> and like I say, this is Box Break Tuesday. We have a 1920 Upper Deck Lure. This is the second box we opened. Uh, the first box we opened, we did pretty good. We got a nice Ilya Mikheyev. Uh, autograph? Yeah, blue line, blue line rookie and autograph. And some base card rookies of Kale McCutton. Yeah, that's true. And I think we got a two Voter Von and a uh, patch card. But all in all, not a bad break first time. Uh, okay. So what we're looking to do is hopefully continue the birthday magic for moms. Because mom bought a great box before. Let's see if she can do it again. Mom's really special to the family. So I think this is like special boxes. Special boxes. Got the birthday magic boxes. That's what Ben likes to call them. Yep, yeah, birthday magic boxes. Mm -hmm. Well, with any luck, like I say, uh, we'll see what this one can generate. Who knows? There could be... Uh, Kale McCarty, okay. I'd like to see. Well, hey, we got a Kale McCarty out of Blast Mom's box, right? Yeah, that's So maybe uh, her, the second yeah. hockey box she buys has another Kale McCarty. Imagine if we got this card signed by the real Kale McCarty. Wow. That, right. that had so much value. Okay. All right. So eight packs, uh, six cards per pack, 2019 Upper Deck Allure. This was the first year of Allure. They have Allure in 2020, of course. Um, but 2019 had a great, great rookie year, great rookie crop, great players. They have a top 50. So there's what it looks like, guys. Maybe we had not seen it. Very chromey card, kind of like a platinum. Uh, but yeah, Allure. There's a top 50 insert of Ryan Kuffner. And a top 50. Oh, there's a patch card. Uh, I think we get one of those per box. What do you think, Ben? I love that. Yeah, Vitaly Abramov. It's not numbered, but uh, yeah, nice looking card. A rookie of top Cody 50. Glass. Base cut. Cody Glass, rookie. And Carey Price. And a Carey Price base. One thing nice about these Allure, same but similar to Platinum, uh, you're getting basically half a pack of hits, half a pack of base, maybe even sometimes more hits than, than base. So I believe last time it was like half the cards were. Oh, we got a Miko Ranton and base. Matthew Kutruck. Yep, uh, Miko Ranton and base card. Uh, Zach Senishan. Zach Senishan. Um, yep, yeah, that's his rookie card. Brady Kachuk. This is a white rainbow. Yeah, just a die cut. It's got the little rainbow sheen to it. And they call it a white rainbow. Not numbered, but uh, an and insert. And a of... Uh, Taro Hirose, a rookie for the Red Wings. And a Jordan Bennington base card. So right now, I'm thinking our, our hit so far is our nice patch card. Who knows? The autograph may just change it out. Yep. Yeah. Oh, Ben's adjusting the band-aid there. He must have uh, scraped the finger with me. All right, up next. So we are on pack three. So, yeah, so another five packs left. Short short break with these boxes, but cards are quite nice. Short break. Short, but fine. Mm-hmm. All right, Ben, hand them over here. There's a Tyler Sagan, uh, Matt Dumba. We got a top 50 there, got, Alex, Alexander Tixie. We got uh, Dylan Larkin. So Dylan Larkin, red rainbow. So like like the white rainbow, this one's red rainbow. Yep, and then two base cards. And two more base cards, yeah. Oh, Tuck and Stamkos. Still looking for our autograph, and I believe a numbered card. Typically speaking, I believe you get one numbered, one auto. Uh, not yeah. to say that the auto and the number can't be the same card, but... Uh, Who knows? We'll see. All right, uh, we are half coming up on halfway through the box here, Ben. Box pack number four. Four down, four to go. Uh, Joel Pavelski, uh, Austin Matthews. Hendrick Yeah, Winter Storm. Hey, Retired now. Oh, we got a numbered auto, five out of ten. 
Five out of ten. Oh yeah, look at that. Cam Atkinson. Five out of ten. So uh, yeah. That's a good card. Yeah, Atkinson's a good uh, player. Good player. He's not a superstar by any means. It would have been nice if it were like a big big name, but very low numbered uh, card. Card. Yeah, Oliver Wallstrom rookie and a Ryan O'Reilly. But that's a very low numbered card. Uh, one thing, unfortunately, about the lure, they are sticker autos, so the players will just get a big sheet of uh, stickers and have to sign them and send them back. They don't even know what the card gets stuck, what the sticker gets stuck to. But uh, Cam Atkins in there, guys. It's five, number five of ten. Purple Diamond Auto. Purple Diamond Auto. Okay. okay. And a Capo Caco rookie. Uh, Nathan Bastion. That's white. a white rainbow rookie. And a Dante Fabro top 50. All of these are rookies. And a Ryan Paling. Oh, look at this. A full pack of rookies. Here we go. Noah Dobson. Max Jones. So, yeah. Noah Dobson. We have an auto of Noah Yeah, we got a couple of RPAs of Noah Dobson. He's a great defenseman. He'll, he'll be on the Islanders for a while as long as they keep up the... Keep them there's interested in playing. There's McDavid. Oh, yeah. There's Connor McDavid base card. There's a Gillum Breeze bra. A Johnny Goodrow iced out. Iced out Johnny a Goodrow. White yeah, Rainbow that's Connor different... Halbuck. Yeah, and there's a White Rainbow Connor Halbuck. Seems like we're getting more of the uh, and Erasmus Sandine rookie. Get more. Um, what do you call it? Uh, older players, not not as many rookies in, in regards to the inserts. Last box, I think we are most of our inserts were all rookies. Uh, Alex Debrinkit. We got a Jimmy Schultz rookie. And yeah, top 50, a Trent Frederick. We have a number code 46 of 99. Oh, well, okay. There's a Zach Zenishin. Uh, or Zen, yeah, Zenishin. Oh, and look who's following up behind. No, there is there's a base a card. Base card of Green Quartz, 46 99. So I'm not Last sure. Pack. I'm not sure about Z Zach. I'm not a big Boston fan, so. Uh, well, maybe. Our grandfather can tell us a lot about that. Yeah, well, maybe Poppy will know. Okay. If uh, old Zach there's worth anything or worth keeping. Last pack. Last pack of the box. Birthday box concluding here, guys. Uh, and then we'll move on to. Uh, oh, band aid fella. Back to our regular stuff, I guess. Dante Fabro, oh, nice rookie. Jack Hughes. Oh, that's nice. Kind of. That's kind of nice, Ben, because that's a rookie card. Open ice. It's a nice little die cut. Um, Jack Hughes in his rookie, rookie year. rookie, Blake Lizott. Yeah, there was a red rainbow of Blake Lizott, rookie. And then... And then, uh, yeah, Max Domi, Anders Lee, face card. So there we go, guys. Box. Yeah, not too bad. Got two number cards. Yeah, two, you know, fairly low okay. number cards. Yeah, this uh, is the one we pulled in seven pack Sunday. Five of ten. And a world card. Out of 99. Uh, yeah, I think, I think I... Unless I'm not sure about Zach. If Zach's playing well with the with the Bruins and uh, you know one of their primary players, then well that card might have some value. But I, I kind of like this Jack Hughes one to be honest with you, Ben. Uh, I really like. It's a nice insert, yeah, and he's it's a great kind of player. That you can stick your finger through. The <laughs> yeah, exactly. And the rest there are just base inserts and some nice rookie cards. All in all, though, if there's a Columbus fan out there, a nice 5 of 10 will do well for them. Boston fan, of course, Zach Senesh and Green Quartz there. But, yeah, not a bad box. Uh, that would be Box Break Tuesday, and that would conclude uh, the boxes for Mom. So uh, up next would be Mail Day Friday, which case mm -hmm. we'll see what we have coming in the mail, if anything. And, um, yeah, we'll have to start planning out some new breaks and packs. We've got to add some packs to our 7-pack uh, Sunday box. We'll do, go back to that next Sunday. I know last time we did the gold box, so we'll definitely get back to the... Uh, Win the packs. Yeah. Because we treat our packs a lot better, and there's more I value. think we have more value in our packs than gold box puts in theirs, because uh, gold box is, hit, is 0 for 2 in the last two boxes they've sent us. So we'll see how it works out. But yeah. either way, guys, thanks for watching. Please like and subscribe and if you haven't. And hit the bell notification. And we will see you guys in the next one. Bye, everyone. Bye-bye. Thank you.